Welcome back to Mario Kart Wii! I am Monty. That's me. Look! Look! There's me! Get it? Me? Because you play with me characters? That I'm sorry. I will shut up for the rest of this video. That was... That was bad. That was very bad. Um, yeah. So, in the last episode, we used this little dude and we played a mushroom cup and this time I want to get a different size character in there so okay in this game there are three weight classes there's the little guys which are these two rows and then there's the medium characters which are these two rows and then there's the heavy characters which are these two rows and I actually want to go with Donkey Kong Donkey Kong's fun I like Donkey Kong and each different weight class they each get their own their own set of carts and bikes. Why did that take me so long to say? And today I'm gonna do the Phantom, because we did a bike last time, so let's like do a cart this time. And yep, and Flower Cup, because that's what we're playing. We're playing the Flower Cup, even though my video says it's recording as the Star Cup. But that's a lie. But you don't know that. You only know that we're playing the Flower Cup. Because I tried to play the Flower Cup, and then I was halfway satisfied with the result and then I tried to play the Star Cup and I was like nope this is not happening and then I realized that the Flower Cup was actually pretty shit this episode. So I decided I am not about that. I want my I want quality episodes and that was something I had not made. So that is something we will now make. Is a quality episode. Cause look at that. Look at us being quality already. Quality in first place. But quality over quantity, in my opinion. Except for Thin Mints. Okay, it's Girl Scout. What just happened? And who do I have to blame for it? Nah. Yeah, so it's Girl Scout cookie season right now. And, oh man, do I love Girl Scout cookies. They are actually my fave thing ever. Oh my god, especially Thin Mints. I could go on and on. I have some Canadian friends, and I feel really bad. Okay, I'm not certain, because I've heard conflicting stories. Some people say that Canadians do have Girl Scout cookies, and some people say Canadians don't have Girl Scout cookies. So, if you are from Canada, please give me a definitive answer whether or not you do have Girl Scout cookies. Because, like, if you don't have Girl Scout cookies, I feel so sorry for you. That's, like, they're my reason for living. Yesterday, I spent, like, $20 on Girl Scout cookies. And I have exactly zero regrets about it. Like, that was such a good idea on my part. Such a good idea. And yeah, but unfortunately they were sold out of the mix. Like the little stand I went to. So I looked online, because Girl Scout cookies now have like the online thing. Like you can look and see where people are selling online. And so like, I went online and I found this little place by, so I live maybe five minutes away? Yeah, five minutes away from this really good hot dog restaurant. It's super good, super quality hot dog. And there, I looked online and it said that there was a little Girl Scout cookie stand right outside that there were some people selling Girl Scout cookies. And I was like, and so I had to go to the bank already and deposit some stuff and get out some other stuff and just do general bank things. And so then I was like, you know what, while we're here, oh, also shortcut. <laughs> but yeah, so while I was at the bank, before I went to the bank, I was like, you know what, let's also go get Girl Scout cookies while we're out. Because they're like pretty close, it's not too far out of the way. Actually, that's why it's pretty far out of the way, but I really wanted Girl Scout cookies. And I got there, and they had all their Girl Scout cookies set up. They had all the cookies, like all the different types, like set out and there weren't any Thin Mints. And I was like freaking out. I was like, where are your Thin Mints? Where are your Thin Mints? And then I asked them, so I was like, okay, what kind of cookies do you guys have? 
And then they listed out all their cookies, and they're like... And we just pulled out our last box of Thin Mints just five minutes ago, and I was like, shit! I wanted those Girl Scout... I wanted those Thin Mints. Those Thin Mints are amazing. Like, honestly. But it's okay. I had... That was like the third time I bought Girl Scout cookies this year. And... And the first couple times I bought Girl Scout cookies, I got Thin Mints. So, like, I still have, I think, a box of Thin Mints left. I still have some, for sure. I for sure still have some. I think I have a box and a half left. And so I'm saving those for the end. But I got some, like... I got some Samoas, which I love. I got some other stuff. So generally it was like a pretty successful successful cookie trip. I have wasted a good like three minutes just talking about cookies. And I honestly have no regrets. I have no shame about that. Cookies are beautiful. Cookies are great. Everyone everyone should eat Girl Scout cookies. Like you should if you don't live in the US, you should find Girl Scout cookies, you should import Girl Scout cookies from like Amazon or something. Because they are worth it. Or like eBay, I don't I don't really know. But from somewhere for sure. Just get your hands on Girl Scout cookies. So good. So, so good. Yeah. Oh, look at that. We're in first. <laughs> Didn't even realize that. I got so wrapped up in my cookies. I think after this video, I'm going to go have some cookies. I bet you guys are bored about hearing about cookies now. But whatever. Whatever. Yeah. It sucks, though, because there's this one girl at my school who, like, I'm old enough where like no one is really a Girl Scout anymore. Like you have to like look for Girl Scout cookies. You don't have people running around your school being like, buy my Girl Scout cookies, buy my Girl Scout cookies. Um, which kind of sucks because like once the people become old enough to actually buy the Girl Scout cookies, people start to stop are not Girl Scouts anymore. So that's kind of unfortunate, an unfortunate reality. But it is one I have to live with, nonetheless. And so there's this, but there's this one girl left in my school who does still sell Girl Scout cookies. She's still a Girl Scout, and nope, I'm not going to. There's a shortcut right here that I normally like to take. But yeah, she normally sells Girl Scout cookies. And every time that she came around, like, because I sit at the same place every day, and eat lunch at the same place every day. And so she'd always come around because she's friends with some of my friends. Like, we're not really friends, but we have mutual friends. And she would always come around and offer to sell Girl Scout cookies. And I don't carry cash, really. Like, at all. Like, that's just not really a thing I do. Because it's, like, it's pretty pointless at this in this day and age. But like, Girl Scouts, they don't accept cards. So it's like, kind of awful that you can't. Am I not gonna be able to show the shortcut this time either? Nope, guess not. But yeah, so it's like, kind of awful because she always had Thin Mints and I ran straight into that. That was, I have no one to blame but myself. Yeah, so I could never buy my Thin Mints, but I still got some, anyways. I don't remember where I got them. I think my mom picked some up sometime. But, those Scout Cookies are the best. E-D-H. What else? Oh, I love when that happens. If you're in a, in a cannon, when a blue shell hits you, or when lightning strikes, or when there's a POW, nothing happens. Like, cannons are the best places. There's only like 
four in the game, I think. In the whole game. And this is a little trick. If you're in manual, you can get that. Nope, we're not going to be able to get the shortcut that time either. Okay, maybe during like mirror mode or something, I can show a little shortcut. Because it is fun, and you don't even need a mushroom to do it. Ah, I'm really bad at that corner. I'm, I'm sorry. Ah. Yes. Good job, me. Go, me. Is it raining again? Okay, so I tried to record this earlier today, like I said at the beginning, and it wasn't raining, and now it's like raining really hard. And I don't want to walk outside to get back into my house. That's not very fun. Because, like, my laptop will get wet. I will get wet. And it's like, at this point, I think I'd like getting wet, but nope, I don't really like being in the rain. I like the rain when I don't have to actually go into it, but I live in a very rainy place, so I have to actually go into the rain quite a bit, and I don't, I don't like it. I don't like it. It's not a thing I like. Also, I'm really tired. And this track is really hard. I just have a lot of complaints right now, but do I really care? Nope. Also, I'm really glad I, I've said also like 10 times in the past minute. I'm sorry. My repetitiveness. Boy, baby Peachy can go suck a fuck. I don't know where I've heard that, but it's true. That's what, that's what you can do. Honestly, that blooper serves no purpose. It is a useless item. This is a nice little shortcut I like. Right there. It takes some timing, but... But it does. It's pretty good. It takes some timing because sometimes you run into the... Into the mine hearts, and that's not fun. Nope. You are not coming near me. Well, I love the Super Mushroom, and I wish they'd bring it back for another Mario Kart game at Nintendo. It is... It is not fun when someone else has it and you don't. Uh-uh, Toadette. Toadette can, like, not. Toadette can please, like, stop. But all these people, all these people can please stop. Thank you very much. But yeah. Honestly, I like this a lot better. No, I like the... the revamped one, the one in... in Mario Kart 8, a lot better than I like this one. Like, a lot better. A lot better. But that's beside the point because this isn't Mario Kart 8, this is Mario Kart Wii. And look at that, all near perfect score. Nearly perfect, but whatever. It doesn't have to be perfect. You don't have to be perfect because you already are perfect. Wow, I get real, 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 mm. That was, that was awkward, I'm sorry. Sorry for that awkwardness, but look at that, we won. Woohoo! That was fun. And I don't know, I feel like next time we should play as Mario. Start playing as who comes in second. Unless, yeah, why not? Why not? Let's play as Mario next time. That's, actually no, I don't want to play as Mario. I have someone else who I want to play as. I have a different idea. It's not going to be Mario, that's all you know. Look at that, first place, again. Oh, we got a star rank. Oh, I did not expect that. Okay. Well, good job, me.
Hee <laughs> hee. Alright. So, thank you for watching. Let's play Mario Kart Wii. Um, I'm Monty. If you like this video, please do like this video. And if you want to see more, subscribe, because there will be more coming soon. Hopefully, eventually, once I get time. So yeah, um, thank you again for watching, and I will see you.